Ruggers are back in the video, so today is episode 19 of the Road to Glory, so um, this is all going to be a postcom e uh, episode, it's going to be um, about 15 minutes long, so you know, get your snacks, get everything you want, uh, take a seat, get comfy, whatever, anyway, um, starting off this episode, we got so much content in this video by the way, uh, you'd have seen the squad I just submitted for Zhao Felix part, uh, the third part, so I, I'm going backwards on this, um, we're using Allison, so I kept that one in the club, and then um, uh, open up the pack, we open up the pack after each word, so yeah, like I said, this episode's got so much content in, literally, it's, it's kind of mad, but um, first pack here for Kia is not very good, but um, you should, you, you want to see the, the sort of the packs you get from the next uh, two SVCs, so yeah, I've edited it all um, and put it in, and now I'm watching, I'm literally watching it and commentating over it, so um, yeah, this one here, we uh, had to use our inform, I was just checking if I could get away with an 82 for an 83 somewhere, but um, yeah, bought a few players. In total, I think I spent, I think it was 100k on this SVC. And for Zhao Felix, who I've heard such good things about, it's pretty good. So, premium gold player pack, we open it up and we see a walkout. We see the informed flares down in the bottom right. And I'm thinking, who's it going to be? It's going to be Luis Suarez. And you're probably thinking, oh, nice bit of fodder if he was untradeable. It is actually tradable. And we go and check his, check his price in a sec. But, um,. Yeah, let's just say I tried him out for a few games and he was pretty good. We do go on to use him in um, in our team for the weekend league and for Div division rivals. We've got some really good gameplay at the end of this video coming. So, um, yeah, you'll see that. But, um, yeah, lovely pack to bring back some of the coins that we spent on the SPC. Koke in there as well. We check his price now and he's going for about almost 70k, um, 69,000 there. And uh, we do sell him on later in this episode. But there's a reason why we sell him, so you're gonna you're gonna want to see that. Um, yeah, Coke in there. I think he's about 10k as well. That's the going rate, 10 to 12k for like 85s. Um, yeah, he he's. Um, I think we do actually use him though. We send everything to the club because um, he's Atletico Madrid. He'll be useful for uh, the final part of this Shao Felix SPC, which I think he goes into. If I'm wrong, I might be wrong. No, he does. Okay, so um, yeah. We used an 81 inform uh, from the La Liga that was untradeable. Hummels we packed as well, untradeable. Submitted all. It's all gone. And uh, we get a Prime Election Players Pack, which we also get a nice player out of. Um, Zhao Felix completed. Pretty nice. I think he's going to be a really good addition. Well, I know he is because uh, I've used him a lot already. And he's been pretty good in the team for me. So, um, really good stats. 8 10 pace, 89 shooting, 89 dribbling, 82 passing. Decent physicals as well. He's um yeah he's a top class player and that's why we completed him and obviously um, made some coins back on the on this pack and the Suarez pack so this pack it opens up I think it's prime election player pack it uh it's it's no walkout but then I go and see the what I thought was informed flares is actually uh, Europa League Road to the final Kubo so um yeah Villarreal player I'm not I can't remember exactly who they're playing but I know it's a team that they can definitely beat um and um yeah. It's going for about 20k right now, which is pretty low, and that's why we're going to keep him in the club for now. And just wait, if he gets an upgrade, he doesn't, he won't go much under 20k, so I'd rather just, uh, you know, take the risk of keeping him for now. Anyway, this is the final bit of fodder. Well, there is a little bit more, but um, we saw that 86 rated player pack. Bellerin's going in, you might think that's quite bad. We just we use untradeables, plus we bought Gomez for, I think it was 20k. So we spent about 20k on this pack with uh, the fodder. It's big risk. Does it pay off? Let's find out. Obviously, it's going to be a walkout because it's 86 plus, and all 86s or above are walkouts. But is it going to be a good one? That's the question. <sighs> walkout. Spanish. Cam. No. 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 86 David Silva. It's not a good one. I can't lie. That was that was a waste of coins. We literally spent to buy an 86 and then got an 86 back and lost all the fodder. So um, yeah, foot freeze party bag is the next SVC we do. Um, we use you know a bit of some decent players I guess. Beckham you can't ever get him back. We use that David Silva as well. Nian never gonna play for me anymore. Was a good player though, but yeah, we we complete the foot freeze party bag. I think it was worth the risk, uh, but let's find out if the risk was um, a good one or not. So we open it up. You can get good non walkouts, but we do actually get a walkout as you see there. Um, that's the what I thought was the screen thing is a one to watch Moroccan right mid into Milan 
it's going to be an upgraded ones to watch Hakimi. So what I'm thinking now is Inter Milan are top of the league, I'm pretty sure, or second. I think AC Milan are top, actually, Inter are second right now. And I think it's worth keeping Hakimi because they're obviously playing well, Inter, and, um, you know, they could go on and get some more informs for um, Hakimi if he, if he plays, assists, goals, and stuff like that. So final SPC of the video before the Rivals gameplay, Team of the Week player pack came out yesterday. Um... Uh, team of the week one to twelve, so not the latest one, but uh, can it be good? It's gonna be, it's gonna be tough to get a walkout, and we don't get a walkout. It is an absolute stinker. So the last three packs have been pretty awful. The eighty six plus the um, team of the week and the party bag have been pretty bad. But um, yeah, we do get the worst possible in form, a seventy five rated, and he's not even the Bundesliga. But he has an all right card for a German. But yeah, it's not what you want when you submit an eighty three rated squad. But yeah, on to the gameplay now. What I did, I said I'd sold um, uh, Luis Suarez, and that is exactly what we did. So Suarez sold for 69 games, but we did play games on this card, and they were all foot champs. I think we played 11 games of that card. I can't remember what we did, but we went out and bought Luis Suarez back as a ones to watch, only because I'm thinking I actually, I actually really enjoyed him. So he played 22 games with Jao Felix, 27 goals, 27 assists, 14 goals and 11 assists in 14 games for our new ones to watch Suarez. Obviously, we had the inform pack pulled, but um, we bought that one for, I think it was 91k. I'll just quickly show you my custom tactics. 4 triple 2 with Suarez and Jao Felix up front. Puskas as a right cam, who doesn't really get involved. Neymar gets involved a little bit more, but um, yeah, I'm fine with Puskas not getting involved. But Because when he does, he um, obviously does do bits, because he's a good player. And um, yeah, Marquinhos, Kante, CDMs, and obviously defence stays as it is. So, Division run, 1, Rank 2 was sitting on with, I think... Four games to go. We played 26, We're sitting on 12,770 points. So we are well into rank two, but we're close to rank uh, rank one. We need to secure it with these final games. So first game we come up against Neymar and Mbappe, Alessandrini, ba uh, Bamba, Awa, and Marquinhos freeze. We um yeah we take we take the lead first of all. We go um we go with a one two. Suarez and Felix, you'll see that a lot, guys. And um, I kind of panicked, chipped the keeper, but Suarez doesn't miss there. Literally, his shooting is so so good. Literally, that's why I've, that's why I've enjoyed him so much. But pretty shocking defender. I'm not sure where I'm going with that one. And then he gets some jammy finish. I moved Allison to the right, actually to the left, sorry, and um, it just bounced under him. But with a bit of pressing, Kante can slot a great through ball into Jao Felix, and um, he's he's never going to miss that with a finesse shot. He loves a bit of those. And then that one two's back again. Suarez, Mr. Robot Varane is strengthed out by uh, Suarez. And then he just finishes that top left. Isn't There's no no chance he's missing that. We're 3-1 up. And um, this guy just randomly pauses it on an offside and quits. So, yeah, we get we get a nice 3-1 um, win. Suarez with two goals. Felix with the goal. Felix two assists as well. And Kante with that assist through ball. And he had a high skill rate in 1976. Uh, and I had... 1979 so we went up to 1994 their um, skill rating is really good one of the highest it's ever been if not the highest and we do make our way into um, rank one with I think about uh, 770 points was it come up against Ronaldo Pedenz best that flipping annoying Rashford in form and Bruno and Kante I think he plays 4-2-3-1 with Ronaldo up front best right Pedenz left and Rashford behind or it might have been a 4 triple 2 it might have been a 4 triple 2 actually Anyway, nice bit of dribbling with that uh, Rashford, who I knew going to struggle against. Ronaldo with a flip flap uh, sends it out to Allison, and he saves that. But he does go ahead and get the Varane header. Who else would it be? It's always going to be Varane. We do cut it back, get another uh, well a goal here to make it one one with the maddest thing. He tried a fake shot, and I clicked B to tackle, and uh, Neymar's actually gone, and it looks like a finesse shot, but I didn't even finesse. I literally clicked B to tackle. But we'll take those. Div one, you're gonna need every goal you get, um, because it's not too easy. Uh, he does go in with Pedence there after a nice little pass from Rashford, and uh, goes straight back in the lead. Suarez, bit of dribbling, fake shot, ball roll, get lucky. Neymar, fake shot, that was a beautiful touch, literally. And then uh, Felix is there to slot that one in on a finesse shot in the 35th minute to go 2 2 up, and uh, we're liking that Felix card a lot. Bit of bad defending there, I shouldn't have committed with Rio and then I tried to uh, jockey with Marquinhos to grab the ball but went straight to Ronaldo and yeah he's not missing that is he really. And then Neymar, 54th minute, can we get this um, 
golf. We get, we do the, I think it's called a bridge, but I don't know. That might be the, a different skill, but I call it the pace boost. And uh, Van Dyke can't really do anything but hit Neymar down and we get a penalty. Pretty nice. And um, yeah, this is where we can take our chance to go 3-3. Three, three. You know, we got Puskas. His pens are looking pretty good. 99 power, 94 penalties. And um, I did have a look. But then, yeah, we go left and he saves it. So pff, we don't take our chance to go 3-3. Three, three. And um, he actually comes down the other end. And um, Best whips it straight across the box. Ronaldo's there and... That might be his third goal, and then Rashford also goes and uh, hits the hits the keeper. Best with the bit of a spin. Mendy trips over Allison. <laughs> I don't know how that's gone in, but yeah, pretty much we lost. I think it was five two, was it? And that guy had a two thousand two hundred seventy five skill rating. Like that is that's insane. I don't even know how, but um, yeah, nineteen eighty nine skill rating now. Only get three thirty points for that, but we're, we're comfortably in rank one now. We do need to finish our games because I don't want to drop out of it. So the last two games can we get some victories we come up against really lucky eye compacts i'm guessing blanc del piero and cannavaro xiao felix in there as well who we know is going to be deadly and uh, he's on the ball here with a bit of skill moves i've got five star skills and carrasco of all people on, on his team smashes that home anyway xiao felix for us now goes on this is a um, nice bit of, bit of build-up play that i did cut out because it was quite long and um, Jao Felix with this pace boost slots in Neymar and Neymar never misses those his shot power is so good and um, yeah he goes on here with Blanc put it on oh I'm speaking so much but um, yeah pretty much does a little circle with Salah and finds Blanc who just smashes it left foot which is not a bad finish Suarez little one two I paused the queue because I needed something to change and uh, Neymar actually um, smashes that home in the shot power we do go four and two and two despite the goal we we're still going to change but puskas up front dembele comes on as a cam and then atal into uh left center mid you can play left center mid or right center mid with five star weak foot atal of all people 89th minute uh i think it was atal actually uh yeah atal intercepts here plays a through ball dembele plays a through ball into puskas i don't know why i went backwards there and then i went it's supposed to go dembele it went all the way to mendy i thought that pass was offside Puskas is apparently on, plays it into Dembele, 90th plus 2 here guys, Puskas sweats it, Neymar, and he misses the ball, but hang on, he gets the ball, dragged back, and he's being fouled off the ball, and I don't even, I didn't even notice it at first, because obviously I'm looking at the ball, and Neymar off the ball has been tackled by, I think, Ferran or Van Dijk or someone, um, and yeah, we get a penalty, and this time, can we score it? I didn't back Puskas after the last miss. Neymar, we go back to our old penalty. The finesse shot at about this place just seems to work every time. I don't know why, but yeah, it's 3-2 and the 90th plus 3 when it was only plus 2 minutes and we win the game. He's got 1934 skill range, so quite low uh, in terms of who we played, but he was a good player in 2002. So yeah, we actually go up to break the 2000 mark, which I think is my highest ever. So 1464 uh 14,640 skill rating that was kind of a weird way to say it but um yeah he's got a french team pretty good team i guess not not amazing not the best but um yeah this is my favorite goal with Jao felix look at this now the pace boost and then smashes that left uh left foot into the top right one nil to us Jao felix number seven with the atletico i don't know if you noticed but i put the atletico kits on and the badge and the tifo i think um yeah Anyway, Neymar smashed that 2-0. We go up uh, at the other end in the second half. Suarez with a fake shot. And I'm telling you, this guy can finish his dinner. And he does so on his left foot. 92 shooting. Doesn't matter about the pace. Engine card gives him nice balance as well. So he's good. Dribbling and passing is insane as well. He tries his little bouncy thing. Keep you happy. Um, and uh, I guess it kind of does pay off in the end. Because he goes down the other end after a, a uh, interception Mbappe into Alessandrini I'm pretty sure he fakes no he doesn't even fake shot he just dribbles it to the right a bit and um, he sends me and uh, gets a goal back 3-1 oh, need to keep the lead but Puskas is never going to miss that that's what I mean he doesn't get involved much I'm not sure if he's positioning or what but um, when he does he does score nicely so yeah we're in with Suarez and who says he has 73 pace I'm sorry but he just absolutely sent the boy there and uh, the pace boost does well and Suarez bangs that home and that is a 1960 opponent so not a bad and uh, we go up to a 2015 skill rating to for the final game lovely 950 max points 15,590 points 
for the week and that is the end of the rivals and kind of the end of the uh, the video we just end up on this team here um, but yeah we we want to show you the stats here Suarez 18 games 18 uh, goals and 13 assists absolutely incredible then Xiao Felix 30 goals and 34 assists in 26 games he is the star player obviously Suarez in there as well and I've showed you Puskas as well 84 games for Puskas already and uh, Neymar the star man of pretty much the series 265 games on him and 95 on Marquinhos already who's been outstanding Kante obviously really good as well I literally own it because I'm talking so much I don't know why I'm not even tired but um, yeah that is pretty much it for this video um, I'm trying my best to hit um, like just keep pushing up the subscribers around 2100 and about 37 right now so um, if you can help by uh, subscribing that would be absolutely brilliant and um, yeah drop a comment that will help me out get me um, up in the rankings on the search want to get more people trying to watch this RTG it's tough to grow it like an RTG when it's like, like you're not um, not that big of a youtuber but um yeah i guess guess we've got to keep pushing and i like making these videos so um yeah if you enjoyed it please hit a thumbs up and subscribe and early peace